Well, it's sometimes said that religion needs to catch up with science, but in this case, maybe it's science that has some catching up to do. Church Militants Martina Moiski talks about a recent scientific study confirming lifelong learning begins at conception, contrary to abortionist propaganda. Recent studies are confirming what many parents have long believed. Life and learning begin at conception. A recent study from the University of Virginia found a child's propensity for sadness, laughter, fear, and soothability are already built into a newborn baby's brain. Pro-life advocates note the study verifies the uniqueness and value of unborn babies, irreplaceable human beings. It's uh, sort of funny to think that empirical studies are now showing that a child within a mother's womb uh, has feelings and reacts to uh, noise and stimulus and and uh, can feel pain. Other studies are also proving a lot of learning happens in the womb. Unborn babies are learning to hear music and especially a mother's voice. They also practice breathing, opening and closing their eyes and smiling. A child in the womb is far from simply a lump of uh, cells within the mother's body. Since the first century, the Catholic Church has affirmed the preciousness of human life. The Catechism of the Catholic Church states, human life must be respected and protected absolutely from the moment of conception. This teaching has not changed and remains unchangeable. Martina Moiski, Church Militant Evening News, Detroit. Recently, Dr. Kathy Altman from Gainesville, Florida, who performed abortions even while pregnant herself, became pro-life. After she gave birth, she realized the unborn children she was aborting were children just like her own.